a tubule of 300 mm diameter a tubule of 300 mm diameter penetrates fully penetrates fully a confined aquifer a confined aquifer full stop the length of the strainer the length of the length of strainer is 25 meter is 25 meter calculate the calculate the yield from the well calculate the yield from the well from the well under a drawdown of 4 meter under a drawdown of 4 meter the coefficient of permeability the coefficient of the coefficient of permeability of aquifer is of aquifer is 50 meter per day is 50 meter per day assume assume radius of circle of influence r equals to 200 meter let's understand the problem given problem thoroughly a tube well of 300 mm diameter a well is there of diameter 10 mm penetrates fully penetrates fully completely confined aquifer the length of the strainer in the tube the length of the strainer in the tube is 25 meter calculate the yield yield nothing but discharge yield nothing but discharge from the well under a drawdown of 4 meter under this drawdown we need to calculate the discharge yield nothing but discharge the coefficient of permeability of the aquifer k is 50 meter per day 50 meter per day assume radius of circle of influence capital r zone of influence capital r 200 meter just write the given data diameter is given 300 mm this 0.3 meter so from this radius r is equals to 150 mm 0.15 meter and also the strainer length is given l is equals to 25 meter calculate the yield nothing but discharge under a drawdown of 4 meter drawdown nothing but s that is 4 meter okay drawdown s is 4 meter uh, coefficient of permeability is given coefficient of permeability k is equals to 50 meter per day convert this 50 this is per day 50 meters per day convert this to second one day means 24 hour one hour 60 minute one minute is 60 second 50 divided by 24 into 60 into 60 you will get 5.78 5.787 into 10 power minus 4 meter per second correct 5.787 into 10 power minus 4 meter per second yes and we know this relation and we know this relation 
q is equals to b into k into s divided by log 10 r by r q is equals to 2.72 b is given is it given b yes b is nothing but length na strainer length so this is how much 25 meter and coefficient of per millimeter is also given 5.787 after conversion from meter per day to meter per second so this becomes 5.787 into 10 power minus 4 and as drawdown is given this is smallest okay this is the smallest capital S means storativity or storage coefficient smallest means drawdown so this is how much 4 meter overall divided by log 10 of r is radius of circle of influence the the zone of influence that is 200 radius from diameter radius is this is in meter 200 meter so radius is in 0 0.15 meter just substitute in this formula you will get the answer as 2.72 into b is 25 into k is 5.787 into 10 power minus 4 into drawdown is 4 meter divided by log 10 log 10 200 capital r divided by small r is 0 0.15 0 0.15 you will going to get, get the answer as 0 0.05037 correct 0 0.050 meter cube per second 0 0.05037 meter cube per second so multiplied by 1000 so you will get in liter correct so this is 0 0.05037 into 1000 multiplied by 1000 you will get 50.37 50.37 50 so 1 2 3 zeros 50.37 liter liter per second okay 50.37 correct 50.37 liter per second yes 50.37 liter per second this is discharge nothing but yield discharge nothing but yield yeah yield okay let us discuss about one more problem problem 4 Problem number four. <coughs> a well is located in a. A well is, a well is located in a twenty-five meter. Twenty-five meter confined aquifer. Twenty-five meter confined aquifer of permeability of of permeability 30 meter per day 30 meter per day and storage coefficient and storage and storage coefficient 0 0.005 0 0.005 if the well is if the well is being pumped at the rate of being pumped at the rate of at the rate of 1750 1750 liters per minute liters per minute Calculate the 
calculate the drawdown at a distance of calculate the calculate the drawdown at a distance of at a distance of 100 meter at a distance of 100 meter from the well from the well after 20 hours of pumping after 20 hours of after 20 hours of pumping take w u well function equals to 3.35 thoroughly understand the given problem understanding of the problem itself completes half of the problem solution okay a well is located in a 25 meter confined aquifer confined to impermeable impermeable layer 25 impervious strata impermeable layer okay whatever so 25 meter confined aquifer of permeability 30 meter per day okay let's write the given data solution 25 meter confined aquifer that is b value thickness 25 meter okay next what the data what the data is permeability permeability k is equals to 30 meter per day storage coefficient s is equals to 0 0.005 0 0.005 if the well is being pumped at the rate of 1750, nothing but pumping rate, pumped at the rate, nothing but pumping rate, that is Q. Discharge, pumping rate, nothing but discharge, Q, 1750 <coughs> liter per minute, liter per minute. First convert this data, 1750 liter correct liter to meter cube liter to meter cube divided by thousand now minute to second one minute means 60 second you will get the answer as one seven five zero divided by thousand into 6 will get 0 0.0291 so which is equals to 0 0.03 unit is meter cube by second next data uh, calculate the drawdown drawdown nothing but small s at a distance of 100 meter correct at a distance at a distance of 100 meter and pumping hour is given okay pumping r pumping r equals to 20 hours and well function wou equals to 3.35 so these are the given data we need to calculate drawdown s okay we need to calculate drawdown yes we need to convert this data <coughs> 30 meter per day correct so 30 meter per day k 30 meter per day goes to 30 meter per day 30 this is in meter convert this to second 30 meter per day for one day 30 meter so now one day 24 hour, one hour 60 minute, one minute 60 second, you will get 30 divided by 24 into 60 into 60, answer as 3.4722 into 10 power minus 4 meter per second, meter per second, correct? 3.472 into 10 power minus 4 meter per second and q as 0 0.03 meter cube per second yes correct now 
we need to calculate drawdown s before calculating drawdown okay before calculating the drawdown first we should calculate transmissivity t correct transmissivity 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 t is equals to k into h we know this relation transmissivity t is equals to k into h and we have the data okay k is how much k is this is 3.4722 into 10 power minus 4 into h is b 25 meter okay you will get 3.4722 into 10 power minus 4 into 25 you will get 8.68 8.6805 into 10 power minus 3 is in k is in meter per second and h is in meter now this is meter square per second meter square per second and also we can calculate t as t is equals to substitute the given data 30 meter per day so k is 30 meter r 30 meter and h as 25 meter t is equals to 30 into 25 you'll get 750 meter square 750 meter square per day meter square per day okay and also and also we know that drawdown and also we know that from non equilibrium equation non equilibrium equation or Thais equation and also we know that from non equilibrium equation or Thais equation drawdown s is equals to okay drawdown s is equals to q into well function divided by 4 pi t <coughs> we have Q value 0 0.03 0 0.03 into well function is given as 3.35 this is given 3.35 divided by 4 pi and t now listen carefully while substituting you must be aware Q is in meter Q per second okay Q is in meter Q per second so T should be in transmissivity should be in meter square by second you should not use meter square per day this is in meter cube per second okay so now transmissivity meter square per meter square by second okay use the same kind of data uh, t as 8.6805 into 10 power minus 3 you will get 0 0.03 into 3.35 divided by 4 into 3.142 into 8.6805 into 10 power minus 3 you will get 0 0.92 0 0.9212 meter 0 0.9212 meter